Hello and a very warm welcome to all the listeners. Today, the topic where that we are going to discuss is office automation in the sales department. This topic falls under hospitality sales subject. I'm Chavi Sahai and I work as an assistant professor at AISSMS College of Hotel Management and Catering Technology, Pune. So the learning objectives of today's session are, we will learn about the sales office automation and we will also learn about the different areas of automation that are there in the offices presently. So first we come to understanding what do we mean by automation? What do we cover under automation? So it is a method of using various things like computer and machines to help us improve our productivity in the office space and also to create an easier way to do business. It will free up our time. Why do we use machines? Basically, we use machines to improve our productivity. Simple as that. So what do we exactly mean when we say office automation? So moving ahead, what we mean by office automation is that it refers to various computer, machinery, software, which is used to digitally create, collect, store, or manipulate, and also to re relay, as in make it reach various people, the office information that is needed by the people present in the office to accomplish various tasks. Office automation helps in optimizing or automating the existing office procedures. Why do we undertake automation? Simply how we are doing business today or how we are doing various processes today. We want to take them a step ahead, maybe improve the efficiency. We want to improve the timing, etc. That is why office automation is undertaken. So next, moving ahead, we will uh, see what are the various ways uh, in office automation is used by sales department because we are studying it under hospitality. So specifically for sales and marketing, what are the various things where automation is used? Firstly, for sales to record various sales that happen so that we can quickly retrieve any data that we need for past sales that happen, any figures, any comparison with the budget, etc. Also, we use the automation for the purpose of telemarketing. What is telemarketing? Promoting our rooms, the product that is the F&B outlets, etc. to the various guests by the means of automation. Okay, promoting ourselves. Then also to order processing. That means whatever FP or that is the function prospectus that is being made in terms of a banquet function that we are holding in the hotel or for any room booking. All these things are nowadays done using a computer so that there's no chance of any mistake. And obviously, if you use computers, we improve our efficiency. Next, automation is also used at the point of sales. Various F&B outlets, the spa, the health club, all these are various point of sales where the actual sales happen, the cash transaction or the bills transaction happen. All these places are known as point of sales in the hotel. And once we automate these sales, there's ch no chance of anything going wrong. And we can get an updated record at the tip of our fingers as and when we need also, we use this automation for credit authorization. There are lots of transactions in the hotel in terms of sales that happen with the credit purchases. So to authorize whether the guest is eligible for a credit sale or not, we use the office automation systems. So next we come to what are the various advantages of having automation. Firstly, it replaces the human operators in the task that they are involved because it is a very hard and monotonous or physical work. So it frees them up from that. 
also the various tasks that are performed which are beyond human capability in terms of size it being very big or weight speed endurance all these things are done by use of automation so something which is not possible for a human to accomplish we use machines to accomplish that third it reduces the operation time and work handling time significantly okay because uh, automation is undertaken when we want to reduce the time taken for something it is very easy to manipulate you can exchange the data you can store the data better when you are using automation it also frees up the time of the workers who are employed there so that they can undertake various other tasks it is more accurate it optimizes the time also and lastly it reduces cost at all levels that is the reason these are the advantages why we undertake automation in various areas so various types of functions in office automation what are the various areas where office automation is used specifically in terms of sales office first is electronic publishing we'll cover them one by one subsequently second would be electronic communication third would be electronic collaboration then image processing and lastly office management so first we come to electronic publishing it includes word processing and desktop publishing nowadays we all are familiar we use computers and various tools to do all these processes it allows the users to create edit revise store and also print documents various which are used in the office space things like letters memos various reports etc next we come to electronic communication electronic communication system will include uh, email which we all use on a daily basis voicemail fax and also desktop video conferencing next is electronic collaboration which includes electronic meeting and teleconferencing collaboration word itself means wherein two three people are collaborating or working together so it helps us to work together on a collaborative work system you can process or work on a file simultaneously two people they can make the changes to files all this is possible in various automation programs that are available next we come to image processing image processing system includes electronic document management presentation graphics and various multimedia systems to enhance the presentation that we are going to do the system image processing system converts various text drawings photographs into digital form and can be stored in the computer systems imaging systems may also use scanners digital cameras video capture cards advanced graphics and computers businesses today use various imaging systems for various documents such as insurance form medical records and mortgage applications so in sales office we will obviously use image processing for enhancing the presentation that we will make to our guests when we are doing a sales presentation next we come to office management so office management is the actual management that happens using automation in the office space that includes electronic office accessories electronic scheduling of meetings and task management the these systems provide an electronic means of organizing the staff various projects and also the data business dates various appointments notes clients information can be created edited stored and also retrieved from the system because we have used automation all these action can be either done 
in by an individual or also by a group of people that are working in the office computerized systems that automate these office functions also increase the productivity and they improve the communication also within the organization because everything is automated so there's no chance of any ambiguity not understanding somebody not getting the information because we are all at the same page so we come to the end of this session i would like to thank you all for listening in please follow the link that is given in the description box and attempt the quiz on this office automation topic i would also like to give credit to the following sites from where i have sourced the material to prepare this presentation thank you all once again